Hi guys, it's Bonnie Smith. I'm here for Doodlebug and you're going to purchase, if you want, the new Doodlebug line on paperwiz.net. So, Paper Wizard representing Doodlebug Design. We are so excited with this new line. I love it. It's called Candy Cane Lane. But before we get heavily right into that, I want to show you something. Last year, we were told by Doodlebug that we sold the most. <laughs> of these stockings because I kept ordering them and getting them and bringing them back in stock. And they brought them back and got a new shipment in for this year. So we have some of these for those of you who weren't lucky enough to get one last year. Now, if you don't know what this is, it is a Doodle Pop stuffed stocking from Doodle Bike. So it has 12 unique Doodle Pops in it. And you can see here, now sometimes the color is different, sometimes the art is different, but these individual Doodle Pops are not sold like this on their own. The only way to get them is in the stocking. So, oh, I like the white Christmas tree. See now, I know this one came from one with like a green Christmas tree, I believe, because we bought that. But the white one, you gotta get the stocking I like, for. I like the cookies. Well, you always like the and cookies. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. We do a lot of cookies in our house, don't we? That's how I landed my man. <laughs> <laughs> Triple fudge threat cookies. Mm. We'll talk about that another time. All right, so this is on the site, and you can purchase it with your order. I will tell you a couple of things. If you only order Doodlebug on one order, we can get it out much faster to you. If you order Doodlebug and pre-ordered items, it will take us longer to get these to you. So I'm just telling you that right now. If you want to play with your Doodlebug, get it all in one order. And then know that I've given our people some days off next week for Thanksgiving. So really the show is going to start shipping on... November 28th. So if you need it by a certain time, let us know and we'll do everything we can to get it to you. Okay, that's that. We also are going to talk about this in a few minutes. Gosh, you've got so much to do. Should we show them the promo title? Well, that was next. Okay. <laughs> Great minds okay. think alike, baby. Great minds think alike. All right, so now I know a lot of you love the promo titles that we do when it's a collaboration between Paper Wizard and Doodlebug. We get special permission from Cynthia and her staff to create these with their art. We will not sell these. We, are, we promised and contracted and we're not selling these. Please don't ask. <laughs> so if you want this title, you must place an order for Doodlebug items and you must spend $50 or more after any discounts. $49.99, the computer's not gonna click over and tell us you deserve a title. So literally, it's gotta be $50, even or more. And shipping does not count. So it's before shipping and after any discounts. And please do the math. I've had several people disappointed last time because they didn't quite get there, because they thought they were there because they didn't take out shipping. And that's hard because we have 200 of these. Now, I will guarantee if you order today and meet the required minimum, if we go to 210 or 20, we will, we will make sure that you get one. So if you place your order sometime today and we hit the 200 order mark today, I'll go until midnight tonight and make sure anybody who orders today and qualifies will get this promo title. How's that? So if we make 225, 250, that's okay. But after today, if we hit 200, we might be out. I had some people order on Monday last time and we had hit the 200 mark, actually late Saturday night. So make sure that you, if you want that, I just don't want you to be disappointed. I know it's not like I'm doing a hard sale, but it's just, I just don't want to get the phone calls. But I really wanted that time. We're, we're just explaining it to them so they, don't get, so they don't get disappointed. <laughs> yep, we don't want you to be disappointed. All right, 
Where do I go first? New product. So. You're like a kid in a candy store. I am. I am a kid in it. My own little candy store. Look at my little candy store. Ah. We have some really cute samples, too, made by Agit Zapeda de Hernandez. If you remember her, she's one of our sample artists. And also a few cards made by Elise Pennington, our online order manager. So, in fact, Elise designed our make and take this time as well. Thanks, Elise. So, we have a lot to do. I'm going to start with my favorite thing, paper. This is the brand new Candy Cane Lane collection from Doodle Buddy. And you guys, you know me, you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to open it. So let's open this up and take a look at all the fun papers that we have. All right. So, oh, you start off with a beautiful paper. Now, Sometimes I have a hard time using something that's this pretty because I don't want to cover it up. But one of the things I've learned you can do is use strips of it, cut it in half, put it um, just down the side, however you like. And it's so easy to do that way. Plus, I love these colors. And then, of course, we have this darling confetti dot. But let's go a little closer. Look at these. Do you see the little yellow stars? So this is a dot with a little special something in it. And honestly, they do call me B-Side Bonnie for a reason. I love this paper. I, I'm already using it on some stuff. And then, oh, candy cane stripes. It's candy cane lane. You have to have peppermint candy cane stripes. But look at the back. This is one of the, my favorite things that they do. They come through here and they make all these little things that you can cut up and use. You can do tags, cards, you can put them on your pages. They fit in smaller albums. They fit in larger albums. I mean, seriously, when it's me, I need two sheets because I need this. I need lots of strips of this because I like the, the little candy cane look when you cut the candy cane out of this. But I also want all of this to use. So <clears throat> I need two packs or just extra paper. And okay, so nobody does holly and berries the way that Doodle Bud does. Look how fun and flirty these are. You've got their limeade, their grasshopper green. You've got, I believe that's ladybug. And is that cupcake? That's cupcake. The colors that they use. And the, the way I like this too is she uses pink, but it's not too pink for Christmas. It's just the right amount. So, and I'm a mom of boys. I would use this in my book. But here's the problem. Look at the back. Again, I need two sheets of paper. Look how cute. You can do your little, your own advent calendar. You can make, you can put one on each page of a mini album or a full size album to talk about all your December doings. You can use this for December dailies. There's, you put this in your planner. That's my favorite right Well, here. that's my favorite too. I like Sienna. So, but, well, there's lots of cuteness though. And the trees this year are super cute. I'm loving the trees. So that is darling. And You're on a roll, baby. It's doing luck. So they always have one of their wonderful window pane plaids. Look at this. I love it. Again, here's my problem. Look at the back. Oh, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Beautiful snowflake paper. And it's just that soft tone on tone. This is what I really like. When you, they call me B-Side Bonnie, this is why. This it would be a beautiful snow page. Wonderful little snowy cards. All sorts of fun. And the blue has just enough green in it. It's not too blue. Does that make sense? <laughs> I'm funny about color. Oh, and these snowflakes. And now, if you want something more colorful, check this out. Now, I think the yellow snowflakes are genius. I just think they add such a bright spot on this paper. I love all the colors that they've used. But here's my problem again. I want to use all of this. Journaling cards all the way through. For the house. I know, I know, look at Santa, look at Santa in the little car. And that's a doodle pop too. So again, I need two sheets. Oh, and this one. Now normally with Santa, I wanna see some green, but this has my heart. Look at Santa with all the candy canes and the peppermints. Those colors are great. Yeah, they really are, and it's so cute. And this is not a bad backer. It's busy, but it's not huge. So you can use this, but look at this side, Ooh. a frame. I know, I'm like, I like this side, but I also want to use this side, too. And I'm going to show you somebody who did use that side in a project in a few minutes. And, of course, one of my other favorites, the tags. 
I love these. You can put tags on all of your Christmas presents because bam, here's the back side. And you just take a quarter hole punch and tie a little ribbon through there. Once you trim them all, write a cute little note, or even better, put them on the front of a card or use them on a page. I did use one of these in the book and I'll show you that in a few minutes. And it wouldn't be Cynthia if we didn't get something sweet and pink. So for those of you who love pink, sure. you're gonna need two sheets because what you see the back side. Yeah, they're little hearts. But look at the back, boom. And I love all these borders. There's so many things you can do with them. You don't have to use them as a 12 inch border. You can cut little pieces like ribbon and go across your photo mats. You can go down the side of a card. You can do lots of fun things with this. You can even take a circle punch and punch out the little Santas and pop them all over a card or a page or whatever project you're working on. So, oh, and the tree. I love the little trees. So, again, oh, and talk about the little trees. Beautiful. Look at these trees. Look at the colors. And again, that's the Candy Cane Lane. Candy Cane Lane collection, doodle book. And then on the back, if you need something a little simpler, this is l lively and bright. It's little tone-on-tone -tone trees. And again, you know me, if you say Bonnie, I love this, but I'll probably end up using that. <laughs> Actually, I did, and I'll show you. And poinsettias. Now, my mother had a real thing for poinsettias. We always had them just up and down our porch. And again, I was raised in Southern California. I tried to put them on our porch the first year. We were here, and they all died. I didn't understand. <laughs> it's too cold on the porch. They need to go inside. So now, if we have them, they are inside as you walk in the door. Oh, and I show you the back side. A fun and flirty stripe. A fun and scallop. flirty. Fun and flirty. Look at the scallop. It is fun and flirty. You go I love the You stripes. go a little Jen Garner. <laughs> That's uh, 30, flirty, and thriving or something like that. What is that? Yep. From 13 going on 30. Yeah, I'm going on 30 <clears throat> times two. Anyway, here is Santa. Poinsettias, candies, hearts, stars, all the things. That's an all-star paper. I like this paper a lot. It's very usable. The pattern is bright and happy, but it's not too big. And then on the back, now, this is subtle. And when I first saw it, I thought, oh. And then now I see so many uses for this. This tone-on-tone -tone snow is the perfect backdrop for those snow pictures. And then you can pull in some of the other snow or even some of the Santa, some of the trees. It is a phenomenal paper, and the more I look at it, the more I like it. And for those who do Christmas parties and have fun, here are some awesome polka dots. But my favorite side is the B side on this one because it's tone on tone, random red dots. And I there's, love tone on tone. And there's little I, snowflakes on there. Yeah, just like the other one. Let's see if I get. If you can get them, they're in there. There we are. Right. They look like little asterisks. Boom. So this is the paper from this kit, and of course, you also get the this and that sticker that comes with the collection pack. So if you look at all this, you can see all the fun things that you'll get that match all the papers. So let me kind of tidy up here a little bit. Tidy up? No, leave it all out. And I just want to show you, they also have this pack of matching petite prints. And I like getting this, too, because it stretches everything that's in this pack. Plus, again, I told you, if you remember the first time I did Doodlebug on Shop and Show, I told you the top ten things I love about Doodlebug. The number one thing I love and appreciate about Doodlebug, besides the people that work there, are is the fact that they work off a color palette. So if you buy this, it's going to match something from two years ago. If you buy this, you can mix and match it with, let's say, Twas the Night Before Christmas, which was two years ago, or Let It Snow, which was last year. There are coordinating papers always that you can match, so nothing in your stash looks old. It always looks fresh. And a lot of companies won't do that because they want you to buy only the new with all the accompanying papers, and they don't use a color palette. They change all the colors, and you know, I get that. It's a marketing thing, but I love this about Doodlebug. So here's your cardstock pack too. So, and then of course we brought in the essentials pack, 
which has a smattering of the papers and all sorts of little goodies in here, including cute little Santa in his truck with his tree farm. Hold that straight up so we... Can you see it all right? Yeah, just don't want to get glare. Yeah, let me know if there's... Got to show, show everybody. Yeah. What? Now, there's a couple of new things in this collection, too, that you need to see. And that is the notepads. Okay, so here's the thing with the notepads. You can put this on your page. You can schedule it, you can make it, if you're doing a recipe book, you can put the recipe on it, or you can write little notes. You can cut it and shorten it if you need to. I'll show you how. And there's just a lot of things. Plus you can just write cute little notes to yourself because it's Santa and it makes you happy. And here's one that's also super sweet. He has a shopping list. And again, if you trim off the shopping list, you can use this as like your December dailies or this is what we did in December and you can check off all the fun things that you did. Make gingerbread cookies. Make a, build a snowman. If you're in New York right now, I think you'll be building snowmans <clears throat> next week because you're probably snowed in in parts of that area. Sorry guys. That's next level, baby. That's next level. So I think that's amazing. And then I was lucky enough to get gifted one of these. Thank you, Allison and Cynthia. Um, and it's hanging on my purse. This is their Just Charming line, and they're coming out with one new one for each of their new collections through this last year. So we have Santa, and I think this one's my favorite so far, but um, they're all super cute. We had the flamingo in the summer, we had the bee in the fall, and then we've got Santa. When we sell those at the show, yeah, we the people we that see those, it's like they won the lottery. Yeah, I didn't, we didn't bring it up to Lancaster, we sold out. That was the flamingo. So if you like that, um, buy it because I don't know that they make those again. I think they have a set amount. I might be able to get more. You never know. Okay, I'm moving this over, and we're going to talk. We're going to show them the sprinkles. So come on up, honey, and just do a quick over on the sprinkles so that we can. I, I want to get to the book. Left or right? But you want me to lift these up? No, it's okay. so that they're good. Okay. So I think they really outdid themselves this year because these are kind of see-through. They're on acetate. And then, of course, you've got the jewels. But look at the candy canes. Look at all the colors. And then you've got all of these, the Santa, the snowman, the reindeer. It's just, there's so much here. You can do so much with that. And, of course, I always love the enamel dot style, um, the bright assortment. This is the Christmas assortment. And look at the trees that match that gorgeous paper. And then, of course, you have your 6x6 six six pad. Now, I'm going to open this one. I think I'm going to open this one. Let me see. I have scissors in here. I think I moved it. I want you to see. Okay, that was smart on my part. You guys, they package it really well. I want you to see how adorable these papers are show when the they're cover. tiny. Show the cover again. Yeah, we'll go from Here's there. the six by six Boom. paper pad. But look, look how cute this is. It's so small. So every paper we just went over is in is here. In there. No tiny. One. Look. I mean, it's just, it's adorable. Look at the snowflakes, oh my gosh. And you get more than one. So you can have a lot of fun with this. And one of the things I want to show you is this cute little box that Agit made. Let's see if I can actually get it to open without breaking it because I'm all thumbs, you guys. I really am. Speaking of Agit, I wonder what David's doing today. <laughs> Agit has a son named David who likes to come to our office and pick up Hot Wheels. We have a Hot Wheel car club. But look how cute. And she used That's all cool. the tiny papers. Look at the little envelope. It even has a little card in it. Look at this. And the old, there's a little doodle pop. I mean, oh, I just, I, this is amazing. So that is super fun. And that's one idea that you can do with the little tiny papers because they're so cute. And, oh, doodle pops. Let's get this down so you can see the doodle pops. Look at these. How's the glare on that? Hold it straighter up. Like this? Should have taken the glass out, we forgot. No, it's good. Okay. So, all of the doodle pops are shown here for this collection. You've got two shaker pops, the tree and the Santa and the TV, which are adorable. These are cool. I don't know which one's my favorite, but I kind of lean towards, I love the Santa in the car. I think that's adorable. The Santa in the chimney has me too. And I really like the Shaker Pop tree. I just think that's adorable. But 
I also like the houses and the, the TV. people around here and the, the TV is really cool. And so, you know, the TV would be good for like when you're watching, you know, Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer with your kids or grandkids or, you know, just for yourself because it's fun and nostalgic. Or Elf. Oh, well, there is Elf. Santa, I know him. All right. Which is a good lead in. Which is a great lead in to this. Now, what, this is, what is that, pray tell? This is a Christmas mini album. It's an 8x8 album, and it has everything you see here will come with it. It includes an entire collection pack, a few extra papers, a couple of patterned and cardstock papers are included. It includes the icon stickers, it includes this doodle pop that goes on the front, and it also includes two exclusive. Paper Wizard titles. Again, a collaboration with Doodlebug. This is a pre-order, and our plan is to have this shipped out by mid-December. This may ship separately from the rest of your order. That's on us, because we want you to have it if you're making it or giving it as a gift. So, let's get into it. We start with, obviously, the Doodle Pop I just showed you on here. Now, here's one of the things I love about these albums. Look at the quality here. And then, if you don't want to use a doodle pop, you can cut this guy out and put him on the cover instead because then you can use the little acetate sheet because they give you a little acetate sheet for this, but with the doodle pop, it kind of just pushes against it and it doesn't look pretty. So if you want that acetate sheet, you can use the doodle pop somewhere else and use the 25 or another icon on the front. So we're gonna go through this and we're going to go through all the pages so you can see real quick what it is. So it's kind of a combination recipe album, Christmas album, because we include six of the recipe cards and they're from this. There are six designs in this card, so you get one each of each design. If you want more, we do have the recipe cards and we do have these extra page sheet protectors up online that you can get. And those came back in stock uh, sometime this year. I remember last year when we were doing the albums, they were having trouble getting their shipments in, like everybody else. So we've added a few stickers here and there from both the this and that sticker sheet as well as the icons. There's one of the little tags from the tag paper I told you about. And here's one of the little strips from that paper. You can see what I'm talking about, more stickers. And then when you see this, bam. Look at that. That's, that's for Elizabeth. Yeah. This, you guys, this was such an aha moment for me. It was like, how come I didn't think of that? Elizabeth Eason, who works with us frequently and owned a store in Florida and is actually a very talented scrapbooker, taught a class for me, and I used the, the Simple Stories photo flips here. And she says, well, just put them on the sheet protector. Then you don't have to, because I was literally cutting through the sheet protector so you could, you know, have this outside and this inside. I'm like... I'm a genius. <laughs> I'm like, so, ta-da, ta-da, perfect. And then we go here. Well, let's we see this again. page. Hang on. Oh, you want to see another page? Oh, we didn't get to see this page. Don't shortchange our... Well, we also included, we have some Made with Love mini icons left. So, we have a limited supply of the, the book, but we do have enough to also give you some of the, and you'll see here, some of the mini icons from Made with Love are also included in this packet. You get a lot more in this packet than you use. Um, so you're gonna have leftovers, but you're gonna have some fun with them. Oh, they're good leftovers. And though. look at this cute little sticker, Santa tossing presents. He's making it rain. Yep. You also will receive, I wanna say it's six of these sets of little laser cut um, holly and berry that match their holly and berry design that we cut for you and we cut it out of doodlebug paper. And of course, the little tree border that I showed you earlier. Beautiful. Boom. And then here is, it's Santa, I know him. So this can be a fun page for when you take the littles or your pets to meet Santa. Can you imagine Milo meeting Santa? You think I could get him to sit on his lap? <laughs> if he has <laughs> treats. If he has treats, but then he'll take the treat and He'll be run. his best friend. So yeah. that's one of the custom titles you, you were referring this to. Is, this is an exclusive Paper Wizard title. You cannot get this unless you buy the book. And that's in the Doodlebug font? That's the Doodlebug um, capital font and the little script that they use. And another little 
Holly and Barry. Little doodad. Yep, little doodad. And we do cut the circles for you. You will get the red and the white because you might want to journal on that or you can use that as a template. It's a three inch circle, so if you have a punch or a three inch circle cutter, you're fine. You'll also get these. And then these are just more things you can, again, photos, journaling. Here is um, one of the ones from the paper that I showed you, but it was too long. So I cut it up here and then I matched the stripes to make it shorter to make it fit. And we'll have instructions for that. Here's another title from Paper Wizard, Cookies for Santa. And that's the same Santa, obviously. Yeah, that's their Santa. That Look, he's right the, there. In the promo he's, title here. And also right and here. Right there. Yeah. And here's another photo flip. I believe there are four total photo flips. And on this page, you also get some of the cookies that are Doodlebug inspired. Oh, Actually, it's their art. I forgot about those. Yeah, you in the Milk and Cookies. And this is exclusive to this album with permission, but will not be sold separately. The chocolate chips. And there's a little journaling. You can put the date there. You can put your favorite cookie recipe. Mine would be Mrs. Hines' favorite cookie recipe, her chocolate chip cookie recipe. Yep. And then here's another one. Now this one I would I'd like to do like a hot cocoa recipe here because I think, you know, it's frosty and there's frosty. So that's super fun. And then I always like a pocket page. Now here I did cut through so that, you know, I cut, I put a piece of chipboard in there. I measured this. I took a straight edge and just a little exacto knife and cut from here to here. So I want to say about seven, a little under seven inches wide so that you can put things in and pull them out to actually look at them. So that's a pro move. That's well, I, I feel like that's fun, but also that means that people can pick them out. And so if you have small children, you may not want to do that. You might want to leave them in there. They can just take the page out and look at them uh, with you supervising. <laughs> so. This is on the website. Again, there is a limited amount. So how many? When we're out, we're out. We don't, we have like 3,000 of these or something like that? 72. Okay. But we've already sold a few. So. Okay. Well, 71 because here's one right here. So if you want that. Jump. 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 Oops. Sound effects. I, I fully expect to sell out. Um, if not by the end of the day, by the end of tomorrow. So there's that. Now, the other thing we have is all these oh my gosh all these okay real quick i don't have time to dump these out but let me show you they have the odds and ends the chit chat and the bits and pieces now look at the bits and pieces they have acetate in here the snowflakes they're see-through look how cute and you can see on the back all of these are in there and the fun part is how well it coordinates with everything else and here's the chit chat. I have to have the chit chat because it gives you those big titles that you can work with. Here's, you know, Christmas and just look at that one. It's just, it's perfect. So I have to have the chit chat. I always, I need the, I need everything. Complete. I have to have everything. You said that about every single thing. I know, but I have to I have can, it. I have to have it because I already see in my hand how I can use it. So I, so I know your second life. Yeah. You'd be, well, you'd be doodle bug girl. <laughs> so that's all of those and then also we also have to do a make and take but it's a really simple make and take if you guys looked on the page and saw oh I can't remember her name but she put up the advent calendar make and take and she did her own spin on it and it's so cool so look at these if you're a card maker this these puffy stickers are perfect because look how many you get of each line Lots of fun there. And then on the mini icons, what you don't realize is you get three sheets. Look at all the little mini icons. And then of course, the icons. Now remember this also comes with the album right here. And I used almost everything on the sheet. There's only a handful I did not use. So those, that's all through that book. So that's fun. But if you think you're gonna have a lot left over from the icons, after you do that book, you won't. So if you want more, buy more. We also have some of the cuts and stamps online. I know they're going quickly, but look how cute these are. Super cute, super fun. And then we have our makeup cake. 
I'm going to try and do this upside down. It's fun. Okay, so in your package, you have all of these, okay? And then you also have, well, let me take this down. This is how we showed it to you, and this is what we gave you. But here's another fun way of doing it. And, of course, we didn't give you the ribbon. You like that big ribbon not included? But you can put this, and if you want, you can do a little fastener so that, and then just pop it open when you go through. And you can do it for your kids or grandkids and put a different activity for each day of the month. So that's really cute and kind of fun. And this is just a foam core board I bought at Hobby Lobby. It's just a white 20 by 30 foam core board. So that's easy to find. So the instructions are super simple here. You're literally going to cut out each, and look which one I cut out. <laughs> Santa, 25, Christmas Day. And this is the one I'm going to show you real quick how we make it. And it just we give you two sheets of the white cardstock. And you're going to cut those into two and three eighths. So make sure you have a trimmer that can show you the three eighths by two and three quarters, which is six eighths, so that it's a rectangle. And then you'll notice that she said you could use a butter knife or even a plastic knife. So I tried it with a plastic knife to score it. And I put this on it to make sure it fits. And then I took this and I rubbed it right along the edge and then I folded it down, Ooh. boom, like that. And then you're gonna put your glue, I don't wanna glue Santa's face, right here, and you're gonna attach, my fingernails are now in my way, here we go. You're gonna attach Santa to the top there. I might need my glasses to do this right. Yeah, I'm a little off, guys, because I'm not wearing the glasses, so. You can see here that I'm off, so let's try that again. The good news is it's repositionable glue. It's repositionable glue. Now here's the thing. You might want to use something that's a little more sturdy depending on who's going to be playing with this advent calendar. And then here's your tag. You're going to glue that on there. And easy breezy, you're all done. That's your make and take? That's the make and take. It's 25 times over. We're not doing all 25. You got off easy, man. I did, didn't I? But right. I got Mine was much more. harder than that. You are a pro though. And then once you repeat this, do this 25 times, one for each one, we've given you a two inch ring. You just attach it and go. Of course, what you might want to do is write here what you want first, what you want to do before you glue it down. And you can say, you know, it's Christmas Day. You can say snuggle up and watch Christmas movies. Or if Christmas Day is your big dinner, you can say cook and bake in the kitchen with family. You can say open our stockings. There's so many different things you can put here. And I think the lady who posted had some ideas on hers, and I think it was just, I, I loved it. Yes. You know who's watching? Who's watching? Deb and Steve from Austin, Texas. Deb and Steve? She has a question. Yeah. She's, she's seen so many great things, and Deb always orders quickly. Yeah. Now she wants to know if she can add to her order. Deb, place another order, and we'll, we'll try to combine those for you. It's easier for our staff, because once we start you know, combining, um, things happen, <laughs> but we'll take care of you. If you have a problem with that, give me a call or shout out and we'll talk. Okay, here is, and we're gonna post this, we're gonna take a picture and post this. This was made with only the collection pack. And this was by Agit. And then she did add a little bit of cardstock and a couple of paper clips. And reminder, what collection pack is that? What's it called? Candy Cane Lane. Candy Cane Lane, there you go. Yeah. I knew the for answer. I just want you, that was for our customers. For those of you who missed out on the box and really want to do an advent, well, did you notice the paper with the advent calendar? This was also a geat, and she bought this frame. That's I want amazing. to say it's at Michael's. That's amazing. And then she did all these little cards. Look, and so similarly to what we did. So this is like a pro model. This is well, this is this is not the model we can put as a make and take because um, this would be like fifty bucks. <laughs> Actually, probably more like six. I don't know. We got people. Yeah, we know people. I know Jody King. She want, she want that. I'm trying to think if I didn't show you anything else. Oh, this is another cute card Agit did with the mini papers and then the big stickers and the other little um, sprinkles, and it's acetate. Look how cute that is. I th I thought that was so clever. 
And of course we have our darling little tree. Oh, and for you collectors. Don't forget. Boom. The shadow box insert kit. With the jewels. With the jewels. And those come, everything that's in here comes in that kit. Um, the shadow box is separate. Now they, they have shadow boxes too. Um, honestly, I don't care to ship shadow boxes because of the weight and the glass. This came from Michael's. And that's what, seven inches? That's an eight by eight. Eight by eight. Eight by eight. And then I'm thinking, we're about, we're almost done. But How we do it on time, sure. baby? We've got, we've got a couple more minutes. Okay. We're about done with our slot. I want to make sure I didn't miss anything. You guys are so many cute things. Um, oh, at least made this cute card too with the papers. I thought this was clever. I like the color block. I like the addition of the silver string. I'd use gold because I'm a gold person, but I think it looks really good with the silver, so I might change. And then she used a little bit of the extra paper from the petite prints. So, and she just used a basic white card kit to build that on. Dee Hanley says that when she grows up, she wants to be a doodlebug girl too. Hi, Dee. And then this one also is another inky one where she actually, oh. she cut on her Cricut her own foam um, snow globe and put sprinkle stuff. There's, she put stuff in there, the little sprinkles from the bits and pieces, I think. And then look at that and that cute paper. So there's so many different things you can do with this kit for Christmas, for your scrapbook, for mini albums, recipe cards. I feel like, I feel like we, there's, I feel like I didn't talk about everything. You guys, there's so much. It's so fun. It's bright. It's wonderful. Can you tell I love Doodlebug? We love Doodlebug. And we'd like to thank Cynthia and Allison and all the crew at Doodlebug for making this happen and for allowing us to use their darling art on our book and this. So promo title is right here. You have to spend $50 or more after the discount and before shipping. Please do your math. I hate disappointing people. Yes. So. And here are your codes. SSL15 will get you 15% off 40. SSL25 will get you 25% off $75 or more. So First 200 will get, get, get the title. Get this title. And, and again, I guarantee it, if you qualify for the title and your order is placed by midnight tonight, you'll get the title even if I have to make a handful more titles, even if I have to make a couple dozen more titles. And if they spend over $100, free shipping. free shipping. And again, after the discount, I had a couple of people spend more than 100 took their discount, and now it's under 100 and they're already emailing me going, I didn't get free shipping. And I'm looking at their total going, I'm so sorry, it's $93.95. So make sure you do the math. Make sure you get your best deal because this is a good sale. I'm Bonnie Smith here from Paper Wizard for... Doodlebug design, you guys. Merry Christmas.